Hey everybody, um, this is live, 5 a.m. West Coast time. Um, I had a dream and I got to share it. This blew me away. I've never done this before where I've actually come on live and just, I'm making a recording right now for YouTube. And I wanna, I'm recording it as well as being live on the show. Um, it looks like 5 a.m. West Coast time. Actually, it's 5.20 a.m. 5.20 a.m. West Coast time. Got 20 people in the chat room. Uh, 5.20. I'm still kind of half asleep here, but I, I talked to Carla, shared the dream with her, and I thought I would just get up and go ahead and share it while it was still fresh in my mind, go through some of the details, and then post it on YouTube. Um, how many of you guys are out there? I see 19 people in the chat. You guys are here early. Um, is anybody here? Hello? Anybody there? Testing. I guess there's not that many people in there. It looks like there's a few people typing, but you guys are like look like you're asleep, too. <laughs> Noah, can you hear me, Noah? I saw you just typed something there, Noah. All right, I'm going to talk about this dream here in a second. All right, well, what happened in the dream? For all you guys that want to know the dream. I was seeing what looked like a, the moon, like another moon. It was bigger than the moon. And, people, and I remember in the dream, people were saying, it's just Jupiter. So there, people were trying to, to calm everybody down. Oh, it's just Jupiter. And I was like, that's not Jupiter. It reminded me of that movie Melancholia. I went online and I checked out the movie Melancholia about the that another planet that hit the Earth. And it, it was very similar to that in my dream. And I remember looking at it and, and I heard this saying in my mind, well, Tomorrow, if you look up and you see a shadow, if the sun looks different and there's a shadow, then what what you're knowing is real. This is real. This is this is really happening. This is not just dreaming it again. Because I dreamt about this about three or four days ago. Something hitting the earth, and then all this stuff started coming out about YU55 in the in the mainstream. So I'm trying to think: Am I just dreaming this because? There's everybody talking about it, or did, is this really prophetic? Is this really a prophetic dream here? So in the dream, um, I look up to see the shadow of the sun, or if I, I'm looking to see if there's a sign, right? And I see the I see this planet, and it looks like a planet. It, it's huge, and it's round, and and people are saying, "Oh no, it's just Jupiter." And I'm thinking, I've never seen Jupiter like that and I've never seen it in the sky that's not Jupiter and as I was watching it it was getting closer and it I thought it was going to pass by but it, it got really close and I began to hear it and I felt it as it was getting closer I could feel it um, and and I saw it fly by the earth and, and, and then I knew it was going to hit and it hit the ocean in the dream. It hit the ocean. I saw it hit the ocean. I saw it going down into the ocean. And I could hear the water. It was like, I thought, I, in the dream, I thought, well, maybe it'll stay, it, it'll, the ocean will take the impact. But it was so big, it was so big that I remember, I remember the mountains I remember seeing the mountains, like I was in the mountains, because I am in the mountains now of California. And if this thing hits on the West Coast, if it hits anywhere in the Pacific, if this is truly, my dream is true, and it does hit in the Pacific, the mountains are going to be over, washed over. <laughs> okay, because in the dream, I saw the water coming, I heard the water, I, 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 it was like I, I knew the water was coming. Okay. Now, in the dream that I had, or... Yeah, the dream that I had five days ago, and I posted it on my, my live stream channel. For everybody that wants to check it out, it's at propheticseer.com. 
I can't remember what day it was. It was like five. It was like five days ago, four or five days ago, that I that I shared this. But I had a vision and a dream. Like when I woke up, I had I had like a waking vision, and then I went back to sleep, and I had a dream. And in the dream, the vision was that we got hit by something. I felt the whole earth shake, and I was in the mountains. Uh, no, I I knew that we got hit. Okay, the dream part was about the mountains. And then I saw myself in the mountains again, and I saw water coming over the mountains. And I was like, what is that? Why? And I saw water just coming down. And then all of a sudden it started to shoot up like a volcano. And I didn't know. I thought maybe it was a volcano in the dream. But it was water. It was water filling the, the valley. It was coming over the top of the mountain, kind of similar to that movie Deep Impact. But the water was shooting up like this. Well, what I thought about this morning after I've had this dream is that the water's force and the um, the force of the water hitting the mountains was causing it to shoot up. And I didn't think about it until just now that what I saw in that other dream was water shooting up looking like a volcano but it was the water's force was coming so forcefully that it was shooting over the top of the mountain. So This dream really, I've never had a dream like this before. It was so real. And um, with everything that's happening right now and everything that I've seen, I, I don't know if it's just me dreaming, but it, it was one of the most real dreams I've ever had. And um, and so I could see it. I mean, I could hear it. I could feel it. It was almost in color. The dream was almost in color, too. And um, I just want you guys to know that it's possible that this could be prophetic. Please, if anybody else out there has had these dreams, I'm going to be scouring YouTube for dreams that people have had lately, water dreams, whatever. Um, I'm I'm really po I'm really thinking about leaving like California right now. That's that's how that's how that's how impacting this dream has been to me. Is that I'm thinking about getting in a car and just driving to the middle of the country <laughs> for a couple of days, you know, for four or five days, just, you know, a week, just to see, just in case that this is not real, okay, because this thing is supposed to be coming by in the next, what, four or five days, and I, I don't think I want to be anywhere near a coast. I don't think I want to be anywhere near the coast. So, um... But then again, I, I'm ready to go as well. I'm ready to die if it's if it's my time to go. Um, I talk about the Lord every night on the, on the show, and I I share the Bible and I, and I I talk to a bunch of people here at propheticseer.com for everybody out there that wants to show up, be there tonight. I'm going to be talking about it. Um, but that's where we have to be, ready to go at any time, all of us, you know, because we never know when life is going to end. Um, whether it's for us personally or if it is a catastrophic event, you know. But I have to wonder uh, about this dream. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And God bless you. I'll be talking to you again today, I'm sure. I, I probably will be making more more videos today. And um, and then make sure you're there tonight. PropheticSeer.com God bless.